I'm Emmanuel, and welcome to my workbench. Today I am doing day three of a lost expedition from uh, Osprey Games. If you haven't seen the first couple of videos, I will put a link up here to the first video in the series, and uh, you can follow along. So let's get right into it. Draw six cards for day three. Two, three, four, five, six. There we go. Let's see what we had. We are on card six. We have seven, eight, and then card nine is the fabulous, mysterious lost city of Zed. So healing herbs, skip the next card, use a leaf, heal twice, but add a card to the end. I like that one. Generally low number cards generally are better than high number cards. That being said, here's a high number card. This one's not bad, Awa. Gain a orientation expertise, or use a food and hike, or use a food and a heal one. That's not bad. Here's card number two, Shinguano, or Shinguano. Use a bullet, which we don't have. So this one is, uh, unless we find a bullet, uh, we can't do the first option. Uh, use, lose two health to hike, or kill off an adventure. This one is bad. Well, forget what I said about generally low level cards being good. This one is bad. Uh, we can't do any of these yet. So uh, maybe in combination with skip the next card, we'll have to see. Then we have, oh, I like this one. Uh, lose a food to uh, skip the last two cards or uh, lose a health and use a orientation expertise to hike or eat a food, use a food and use a camping expertise to hike. Ruins. Okay, we'll see how we use that one. Pounding rain, lose a camping expertise, lose a food, swap two cards that come after this and then skip the next card. This one has possible uses. And the electric eels. Add a card blind to the end of the list and then optionally lose a health and gain two food. Okay, we will begin by drawing the two cards for the morning phase. We get ants, skip the next two cards, and uh, optionally lose a life to get two food, uh, lose a life to get two food, or lose a health, I should say. And Bushmaster. Use a bullet to um, gain a food or lose two life. That's bad. This is going to uh, kill our, both of our characters unless we can heal. So it, is there anything that we have in our hand that can skip this card? Let's see. Number 10 can skip that card. Yeah, it'll have to be number 10. It'll have to be number 10. So I'm putting number 10 down over here. And we have to pick a second card. So th hopefully this card will be skipped. The next two cards are skipped. So I'm going to try to put a bad card over here. Which is a bad card? Um, let's see now. I don't like this card. I don't like this card. So you know what? I oh that's number two. That'll that'll float up to the front because it's right now in the morning phase. You have to put the cards in numerical order. Uh, so it'll have to be a card that is higher than 24. I will put 37. And then we draw a card from the deck and we get number 56, the swamp. Add a card blind and then lose a, uh, either an orientation or orienteering or two health. That's a bad card too. So let's put that over here. So, so far this one here is skipping those two cards. I have to put another card down. So ideally I would put a card down that's less than 24. So let's see what we have. We only have this one and this one is nasty, nasty. So we're going to have to, uh, do I have something higher than 56? Nope. So let's see here. Whatever card I put down will get skipped by this card, by the ants. So uh, ruins is good. So it'll have to be pounding rain. So let's put pounding rain down. I apologize for my dog barking. If you're hearing my dog bark, let's execute. A path for day one. So we start at the beginning. Skip the next card. So that's this one. Optionally, we can use leaf to heal twice, but, and, but we have to add a card blind. I think we're going to do this. We have leaf right here, leaf expertise. So I will expend this. 
it'll give us two health, one on each. We'll put one on each of our adventurers. Let's see here. We're using up a tent over here. Do I want to put more two on one and one on the other? Let's see here. Um, we are we're going to be skipping these two, and we're, we're we can we don't know what the future holds. I'm going to play it safe, and I'm going to put one on each. And then we add a card blind. Here is the card that we're going to be adding blind. Uh, Bakairi. Or Bakairi. Use a food to get a tent. Use a bullet to skip two cards or lose two health. A lot of these lose two health cards. So that goes to the end of the path. We're done the healing herbs. The next one is easy. Skip the next two cards. So we get rid of these two. And optionally lose a health to get two food. We're losing a food over here. That would be the easiest one to do. And we need a food for the end of the morning. And we're using a, uh, we're going to be, we're going to be losing a, um, an orienteering here. So what I'll do is I will remove a health from Inez and we will get two food. And that's the end of this card. The next card, add a card blind to the end. We get, whoops. We get insects, lose a uh, orienteering, skip the next card, gain a leaf, and remove the last card from the path. Okay, next we either lose two health or lose an orienteering, so we'll lose an orienteering, so Isabel loses a health. That's this card. The easiest one for us to do is lose a food to get a tent, a camping, so there goes the food, and camping goes over here. And the last one, we have no choice, but Isabel doesn't make it. We lose Isabel. She passes on, doesn't make it to the city of Zed. Uh, we have no cards to skip. We do get to keep this uh, jungle expertise and there is no last card uh, to skip ahead. So that is the end of that path. And poor Inez all by herself in the jungle, feeds herself, eats one food, and we go to the evening phase. Here we are at the evening phase. I have to put down one of our cards. Let's see what we have. We do have food, but we don't have any orientation uh, expertise. We have tents over here and leaf and leaf, but we don't have any orientation expertise. And I like this one to use the food and get rid of the last two cards. So, Let's assume that we're going to use a food to hike over here and we're going to use a food. Oh, I can't use two food. I need to save one for the evening. This game is brutal. And then there's this one over here. Uh, but if I, okay. I know what I, I have. A, I have a plan. I have a plan. I'll start with Awa. And next I will draw one from the deck. So this one is lose a tent and lose two lives. That's a nasty one. Oh boy, I'm in trouble. I am in trouble. I can lose the tent easy enough, but I can't lose two lives. So that'll have to go here. And we have to hope and hope and hope that we can get a card that lets us swap cards out. I'm gonna put this one here next right there. I'm going to put this one over here. My hope being that I can swap these two cards and then these two, these two would be the last ones that we would ignore, which means our next two cards have to be in the front. I don't know if I did the wisest thing. Let's find out what we get. Our second last card is leeches. Lose a life, lose a food and skip the card at the end. I think this is the end of the game and lose two life or lose a food and get an orienteering. Well, this is at the front. Well, here we go. We have no choice. We have to lose a life to get an orienteering. And then over here is lose a life and Ines passes on. And here we are. We didn't make it to the city of Zed. It was a very next card. Here it was the wonderful, mysterious city of Zed. This is a hard game to win. Uh, I can tell you that I've lost more often than I've won. Even with multiple players, it's not that easy. That is that. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this playthrough. 
Uh, this was short, only three days, so I'll, I might uh, record another one. If you did like this video, uh, hit, give it a thumbs up, uh, hit that subscribe button, and thanks for watching.